Hi friends, in this session, I am going to explain about min function in Power BI DAX. This is one of important DAX function in Power BI reporting. If you are watching first time my video, please subscribe and like my channel and also share with your friends. Why? Because in this channel, I am providing complete training of Power BI from beginning level to advanced level and also interview questions, real time project explanation with scenario based, monthly updates, much more updated in this channel. If you follow my classes from class 1, you will definitely will get the job and also easy to survive in real time environment. So in this video, we will deep dive about min function in Power BI DAX. Before going to implementation, let me explain what is min function in Power BI DAX and what is the syntax of min function and what are the examples provided by Microsoft Power BI team. Let me go to my browser to understand min function in Power BI. Official page of Power BI DAX. Min function is nothing but returns the smallest value in a column or between two scalar expressions. That means min function can implement in two different scenarios. Okay. If you want to find the minimum value from any specific column, you just mention minimum of column. Or if you want to find the minimum value between two scalar expressions, then we can write minimum of expression 1 and expression 2. Very simple. Return value smallest value. Remarks. The min function can take a column or two expressions as an argument and returns the smallest value. The following type of values in the column are counted. Min function can work for numbers, text, dates and also blanks. Okay. When comparing expressions blank treated as 0, that is minimum of 1 comma blank, then it returns 0, okay? And minimum of minus 1 blank, then returns minus 1. That means blank treated as 0, so 0 is uh, greater than minus 1. That's the reason why minus 1 it returns. Don't worry, I will show you practically. If both arguments are blank, then minimum returns a blank, okay? If either expression return a value which is not allowed, min returns an error. True false values are not supported. If you want to evaluate the column of true false values, use min a function. Okay, don't worry. I will explain in next coming session. So the given only one example, minimum of reseller sales margin and minimum of transaction date date example also they given and total sales and total purchases don't worry i will explain with more examples so first of all let me go to my power bi desktop to explain this scenario let me load simple data Power BI classes, sample data. So I am taking product. Let me click on open. Don't worry, it won't take much time. So let's take a look. This, yes, this is small table and it contains the dates and all. Okay, let me click on load. table will be loaded depends on the memory of the size of the table don't worry don't skip my video i will show uh, different different scenarios okay so i'm going to data view so go to min function first of all let me complete one by one so minimum function will work for numbers first thing i want to apply see here here numbers are there in quantity there are numbers uh, 10 20 30 40 here minimum value is the 10 so we need to achieve that i just mention min quantity okay you can better understanding 
quantity equal to minimum of quantity just enter now only it returns 10 value okay so it returns the minimum value from this uh, quantity column so that means uh, it working for numbers and second one text come here if you observe here product name having a b c d e f g that means it is a text so min product name next column min product name minimum of product name enter here minimum value is the a correct so it is working for the text also so second scenario also completed next it is dates so here date column is there so minimum means start date it will return so i think second first january 2019 yes first january 2019 you should return new column very very useful min date and max date so i will explain in coming session max date min date equal to minimum of products of date just enter it it always written with date with the time see here 1st january 2019 okay and 12 am so it works for numbers text and dates and blanks also i don't have blank columns here and you, you can try with blanks okay now if you are comparing those see here what i will do minimum of minus one comma blank even though if you don't have values you can take a new measure I just mention um, min compare okay equal to minimum of I want to compare with minus one comma blank drag to report view display the card now see minus one returns that means here blank treated as zero okay that's the reason why minimum value minus one returns so this example also i shown now let me connect to my sql server to show these examples this is my sql server name let me connect to my sql server name if anybody watching first time video please check class number three and four why because in class number three and four i clearly explain how to download and install adventure dw 2017 under northwind databases if you practice these two databases you will get familiar with the real world data so now i will take uh, fact internet sales let me click on load one table ns to share these examples now import is always faster than direct query mode
okay now one more scenario is pending here see here they created uh, two scalar uh, measures and uh, they compared so for that what i will do is in fact internet sales we have sales amount and a uh, freight amount so i will calculate uh, sales amount and as well as a uh, freight amount then i will compare both the values okay right click new measure i will calculate min minimum of sales amount okay so i just mention uh, min sales equal to minimum of fact internet sales now let me drag let's close this first of all let me convert to card to display the number this is the minimum sales amount and i want to create one more measure that is nothing but minimum freight amount minimum of right fact internet sales right now let me drag to report view let me click on card okay now i want to compare these two values compare min sales and min freight okay equal to minimum of so min sales this is one expression and uh, min freight let me drag to report view let me convert to card see here it returns minimum is the freight value i compared these two values so that's the what they are trying to tell you see here they created two measures and compared okay so in this way we can use minimum function in different different scenarios thank you for watching my video if anybody wants special training you can directly email to this email id or you can directly call to this mobile number my whatsapp number also same number you can ping here also thank you for watching my video